Hello everyone. Today we commemorate two significant events in the last days of Jesus life on earth. Jesus arrival in Jerusalem for the Jewish feast of Passover and his painful sufferings. Friends, from the 11th chapter of Mark's gospel we learn that when Jesus entered Jerusalem on a donkey the crowds who had come to celebrate Passover surrounded and joyously welcomed him by spreading their coats on the ground in front of him waving palm leaves and singing hosanna but a few days later we observe from the passion narrative of the same gospel that Jesus was left completely alone in his suffering and death having been betrayed and denied by his disciples and abandoned by his followers Jesus faced his agony in utter desolation He felt isolated even abandoned by God as he endured the shame of false accusations condemnations mockery insults beatings and abandonment feeling the separation from his father Jesus cried out with a loud voice Eli Eli lama samaktani that is my god my god why have you forsaken me friends Abandonment is a common theme in all the synoptic gospels. But to stress the feeling of abandonment and desolation, Mark reports that all of Jesus' disciples left him and fled after his arrest. And he also writes curiously about a young man with nothing on himself but only a linen cloth. He was following Jesus, but after all others had fled, also ran away naked. when the soldiers seized him there is no mention of the name of the young man but it is traditionally believed that the man was mark himself the man probably did not mind facing such an embarrassment and humiliation just to save his own life and abandon jesus to suffer alone friends like jesus we too have our moments of joy happiness triumph and victory There are times when we rejoice when we succeed in life and are elated when we are well settled in life everything sails smoothly the winds blow certainly in our favor our wishes are fulfilled our jobs are secure love is plentiful health is perfect there are also other joyful moments when people acclaim applaud praise honor and support us That is like people singing hosannas to us as they did to Jesus on the road to Jerusalem. Then there is the other side of life, our moments of passion. Like Jesus, we go through fear, distress, anguish, and sorrow and agony and intense suffering. We undergo betrayal, denial, indifference, mockery, loneliness, rejection, false accusation unjust treatment insults humiliation physical agony mental torture and death friends during this week we have the unique opportunity to not only recall the events leading up to the death and resurrection of Jesus but also to contemplate on his perfect obedience and humility as he bore all the suffering and evil with total surrender and complete submission to god so also can we surrender to god's will even it means facing pain and struggle instead of clinging to pride independence or self reliance friends following jesus example can help us greatly in dealing with our daily struggles one thing is certain God does not ask us to endure more than Christ did and he comforts us in all our afflictions. Amen. God bless you.